I represent two countries even though it's one flag on my chest. My name is Grace Jacob Bullen. I'm 19 years old and I'm from Norway, here in Fredrikstad. I'm a wrestler and been doing wrestling since I was four years old. I came to Fredrikstad when I was four years old as a refugee. We came from Eritrea, where I was born, but my family is originally from South Sudan. best part in wrestling is when I go to my club and I meet my friends. We get to laugh, we get to cry because the training is so hard and my coach always says we cry at practices but smile on the tournaments. My coach saw the stone and said like let's go up on it. The first time I didn't even want to climb it and the second time I managed to climb it. The third time he said you're going to jump on it and I was denying it and that's kind of the relationship I have with the stone that I always can do a creative thing that I didn't have the courage to do at the first time I was there. The one place I will remember the most and never forget was my trip to China and to Nanjing. You feel so little but you feel also a part of something big. We came to Norway as a family from the UN. My mother was highly pregnant and she was also really ill. My father, he was always standing in the line every day. But I remember my father come back, he really emotional. He wasn't crying, he's a tough guy. So when we came to the office, we were giving envelopes where he stood Norway and family bull. When I was four years old till I was six, I was always through myself. I could be in the game and play with them, but I didn't smile a lot. I was really quiet at the time. When they see me now, they're really glad and really happy because most of them remember me as the little child that didn't smile, but they know why I didn't smile. I think that the people that was at the wrestling hall in Fredrikstad made me smile afterwards because after a while I knew that we maybe were going to be in Norway permanently. And that's one of the reasons I didn't want to engage with people. I didn't want to communicate with people because I didn't know how long we were going to stay here. I see a road where I go, where you go. Because I have participated as a region so many times, I feel like I am a region, but I can't forget where I come from because that is really important and that's what makes who I am today. Oh, I'm not alone. I want to be at the Olympics, I want to have a degree, I want to make my family even more proud, I want to make my town even more proud, but most of all I want to be happy. Happiness is for me is to be safe, I can say. <laughs> <laughs>